Hey guys, it's Luke, and today I'm going to be testing out whether hyper-threading, otherwise known as SMT, will affect Minecraft FPS performance, or the percentage of the CPU and GPU being used for Minecraft. So let's get right into today's video. So if you guys don't know what SMT or hyper-threading is, it's pretty much a function that makes like fake cores for your CPU. So your CPU might be 4 cores, and then it might be 8 threads, which is hyper-threading or SMT adding the extra threads, which helps with multi-threaded performance on different things and it mostly helps with things like video editing and other production things like that. So it's been shown in the past that disabling hyper-threading or SMT will actually improve FPS. So I was wondering because Minecraft I know is usually only uses one core or thread of your CPU so I was wondering maybe if I disabled the extra thread maybe I could get extra performance. So that's what we're going to find out today. So let's move over to how to disable it. So I'm here in my computer's BIOS settings, and here we have SMT. So your computer's BIOS may look different, and usually I think on AMD products like Ryzen CPUs, usually it says SMT since hyperthreading is technically owned by Intel. So if you have an Intel motherboard and CPU, it most likely will say hyperthreading, and if it's Ryzen, it most likely say SMT. So to turn it off, you just say disabled, and that will turn off the extra threads. And if you have it enabled, it will keep on all eight or double that your CPU usually has will be turned on. So that's how you disable it or enable it. So now let's go into the OS to see what happens. So as you guys can see, I'm playing the gameplay right now on the screen for you. As you can see, without hyper-threading or SMT, my FPS actually went up by an average of 3 FPS. So that could just be based on different circumstances, like different things running in the background on my PC, but it does seem like 3 FPS could be actually a difference based on the SMT, although it was not very big. So I probably would not disable it just because it makes the computer run better to not have SMT disabled and it could be different on your computer based on how many cores you have. Like if you have a 6 core processor it could be different from my 4 core or Ryzen 5 2400G. So those are results I got from my video. Hope you guys liked the video and subscribe if you liked it like I said before. So thanks you guys for watching and I'll see you guys later.